Hi, my name is Chris Berner. My husband and I are the founders of Augusta on Ice. You know, we actually moved to the Augusta area barely two years ago. And when we moved here, we were really trying to figure out how do we get involved in the community and how do we do something where we can make a difference. So what really motivates me and moves me more than anything is figuring out how do you bring people together? Because I think when you have an individual connection, you care a little bit more about that person and what's going on in their life, and then you want to treat other people around you better, and all of a sudden it's this virtuous cycle. And everyone just cares more, and you're in a place that you want to live and want to be. So here we were in Augusta, moved from Seattle. Um, I own an e-commerce business, my husband is in sales, and so we were trying to figure out how in the world can we make a difference in this community. So we did what is the most logical thing you can think of. We started a holiday festival, and it's Augusta on Ice. So lo and behold, uh, we were spending some time with friends just a couple months after we moved here. And they mentioned to us that they had to travel two hours to take their family to really connect and get into the holiday spirit. So they went and did some ice skating and some other holiday activities. But it wasn't available here in Augusta. And so, wouldn't you know it, we have a colleague and a friend in Northern California who for years, he and his wife have been running holiday ice drinks. And my husband Mike was telling me, and this was years ago when we were in Seattle, what an amazing thing it was because it got our friend Pete and his wife really involved in their community. Now, Pete's a city, he's a commissioner in Napa, he's running for mayor, I mean, they're involved with people. Um, but it was the ice rink that really, for them, crystallized what it meant to be community members. So I thought Mike was a little crazy when he told me about this business initially because I don't know anything about ice skating, running ice rinks, anything like it. But what I do know about and love is community and bringing people together. And so um, it made sense as I thought about it that there was opportunity here in the CSRA and in the Augusta area to create a place during the holidays to bring friends and family together, to create memories, to create traditions, and really care about each other even more. So last year was the inaugural year of Augusta on Ice. Uh, we kicked it off last November, and it was crazy, it was huge. We did more than we ever should have, but looking back, you always would do things differently. So it was a 50-day long holiday festival. Uh, it was centered around a beautiful outdoor ice skating rink with real ice. And we also had train rides and Santa photos. We had a community stage where we had performances every day for 50 days. Um, we had an ice slide, all sorts of things for the whole family and friends to enjoy. But it was hard. <laughs> and it was 50 days. And so it was one thing to talk about 50 days before you were in it. But once the first day started and you realized it wasn't going to stop and it was just going to keep going, it was a little bit overwhelming. Um, but it was it was amazing. You know, we had thirty thousand people come out last year, and some of the feedback we got was was the best I could have hoped for. It was that this was one of the greatest things they've seen and people have seen in the area. It was about people really, really making meaningful memories with families and, and thanking us for doing it. Um, and it did everything we hoped it would, which was create community and make a difference here. Personally. It has destroyed us financially. Um, I never thought I'd be in the spot we're in, uh, but there was a lot of investment that went into getting last year going, and so it has been a really tough year for us. And I talk about it, I say it was the best thing we've ever done because it achieved all these community goals, and that's what we're passionate about. But the worst thing, and from a financial standpoint, um, it was a lot safer to have a corporate job back when I worked at Starbucks. So we are doing it a second year now, Augusta on Ice. Uh, some of the things that we learned are people really came for the ice skating, and we spent a lot of our money on the extraneous stuff that it was pretty easy to say, gosh, if we cut that out, the business model makes a lot more sense. And so let's focus just on the ice skating. We've actually partnered with Columbia County this year, and so we're at Evanstown Center Park, where they have built a festival with lights and light tunnels and trains and Santa and all the other things that we tried to do last year, um, built around the ice skating race. So, Augusta on Ice is in its second year. You can come out and enjoy it at Evanstown Center Park. It will be open every single day up until January 6th. And it's a great place for birthday parties, corporate parties. Um, we've got bulk tickets available, and you can check it all out at AugustaOnIce.com. Thank you very much.